going on YouTube? Uh, just sitting here chilling. I want to make a little video here. <clears throat> so, you know, we're talking uh, in the last video kind of like on, uh, you know, the gram weight, what, what you want to pay right now. You know, gold's at like, we're approaching 2,000 an ounce. So, plus two, you know, <clears throat> Uh, this fine gentleman at Harlem Bling, you know, he's always yapping about Jacoji, um, Braden, and, and, you know, about the whole Moissanite thing, and, you know, then you got the whole tracks thing. I mean, I'm seeing more and more videos, so I just thought I'd shed some light. Um, I And keep in mind, this might have been a video where he was, you know, a few months ago, but nonetheless. So, I, I went to his heavy link, which... Braden has nothing but heavy links in stock, um, you know, and if he's out of stock, he's getting them real soon. Um, so he's always saying, oh, we're like at like 40. If gold's at 35 a gram, we're at 40, 45. Um, so I did the math and keep in mind, this is more of a, you know, you can have a run of the mill chain. Maybe his you know price per gram might be a little bit uh, less. And we're talking a nice heavy link. I mean, even this chain does look pretty nice for the most part. Uh, so I, I, I did 3874. Uh, it's a 24 inch and he's, he's apparently saying it weighs 64.5 grams, came out to 60 a gram. So just a little food for thought. Um, Harlem Bling right now is at 60 a gram. Uh, and if we go to, and keep in mind, Braden's having his sale. So definitely hit him up. He's having his sale for sure, guys. All right. And then uh, let's go to chains. Let's go to the heavy. And I believe that was a five millimeter. Yep, five millimeter. I don't know if Braden has them in stock because I'm actually waiting on one as we speak. He does. He probably does have a 24. Yeah, he does. Okay. So Braden's is 38.25. Um, and, and I just will say this. I'll say it straight up. I guarantee you Braden's quality is better. Um, so Braden's is coming in at 69.5 grams. All right. So if we take that 69.5, right now the total is, our total is 38.25. Okay, that's 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 before his uh, sale, so thirty-eight twenty-five. Okay, and then we have sixty-nine point five. Okay, I'm just writing this down over here. So what we're gonna do, you know, ever since this update, for some reason, I don't know what it is, but the calculator's gone. Okay, so what do we got here? So right as of right now, we got 38.25, okay, divided by 69.5. Braden's is already coming out to 55. That's before even his 10% off sale. So food for thought, 38. 25 divided by 69.5. Braden's is, our, is still coming out to 55, you guys. Um, so facts speak for himself. Not to mention Braden's got that 10% off. Let's get it. So let's just give an example here. All right, yellow, 14. I want it. He needs to get my 26s in stock. Once my 26s in stock, we're going to be coming at you with the review. You know it. Let's go. All right, discount code if it's not over with yet. That's why I spent seven grand with him. I took advantage of that real quick. Boom. Uh-oh, Braden still plug in. So we got 3825. Braden's being a super player, saving you $382. That's a grand total of $3467. So peep this. We got $3467. All right, compared to 38.74. And let's get to the basics, y'all. That's what we're here to do, get to the basics. We at 68.3 grams. Harlem's at 64.5. I mean, you do the math. Uh, you know, I think Jacoji's still the way, way to go, guys. I mean... 
Braden's a super player. He's going to take care of you. I mean, there's a reason every single thing is selling out with Braden. Uh, you know what I mean? I mean, facts speak for himself. His customer service is off the chain. Um, I mean, his bracelets are ridiculous. So let's let's peep it out. I mean, and you guys will come to find out after we make some more videos. The heavy link is where it's at for me. That's my number one, my go-to. I'm absolutely a fiend over the heavy links. Um, all right, so let's peep this real quick. So that should be at the top, right? Heavy link, boom. So I just ordered the six millimeter heavy link, okay? It's actually arriving tomorrow, all right? I ordered an eight inch and 18 karat gold. Damn, Braden, you still got them in stock? So I just ordered that. Of course, Braden was an absolute player. We got that disky, the disky, you feel me? We got that. So we got that 10% off of $26.65. That's going to be arriving tomorrow. But um, so, okay, eight inches is 41 grams of 18 karat gold. That's what we got coming in tomorrow. Um, but as, as I was saying, there's a reason every single solitary thing Braden has is sold out. I mean, yeah, the 18 karat's still in stock, but he's about to run out any day. And then, you know, boom, it's going to be a fresh batch coming in. Um, and obviously the 18 karat, the reason 18 karat's still there is because it's just more expensive. I mean, don't get me wrong. There's pros and cons with 18 over 14. You know, 14 is, you know, at the end of the day, you can wear 18, you know, we've already talked about it. Ain't no problem in wearing 18. I'll stand by with Braden on that all day long. A lot of my jewelry is 18. Um, but, you know, you're going to have some dents. You're going to have some dings. Uh, you know, maybe that wouldn't have happened with 14. Uh, I guarantee you, you're going to drop a fatty ring on the ground. Bam, big boy dent. That 14 might have not happened. Um... So with that being said, uh, I'll just keep on saying this till I'm till I'm blue in the face. Braden's just uh, if you guys are contemplating on shopping with Braden, you guys just run with it. There's nothing to worry about. He's gonna message you back. You email him, ask him a question. He's gonna message you back. Now you know sometimes he is busy. I email him like crazy. I got no shame, bro. I mean. You know, and he has not let me down yet. I mean, I, I even told him in the last couple of videos, I said, bro, I know I'm getting annoying. It is what it is, though, bro. When you're spending a bunch of money with somebody. And then again, we had two incidences back to back on purchases that I made that my order was canceled. The next thing you know, I ordered another one in a different size. My order was canceled. So, you know, I kind of blame that for a hot minute on why me and Braden were in contact so much. Because, you know, I don't want to bother him. I just, you know, want to place my order and call it a day. Um, so shout out to Braden. I appreciate it, man. I never meant to be a bug or a hassle. Um, but yeah, you guys, I mean, he's got everything you need. I mean, if we're talking, I mean, he's got, you know, any, any bracelet you can think of. I mean, look at this, you guys, even his, even his mini diamond tennis bracelet, 2,300 bucks, bro. I mean, where are you going to get that? Where are you going to get that kind of online service? For 2300 bucks for a nice, beautiful tennis bracelet, you know? I will say this. Ooh, the next subject I wanted to get on is the rings, okay? I haven't had the pleasure of ordering a ring off him yet. I have a feeling that um, common sense might dictate that because, you know, most of his rings say allow three to four weeks or four to six weeks or I forget what it says, but... Uh, Let's just do this. Yeah. I understand that we're engraving them for the most part, some of these with the engraving. So at the bottom, it'll say, please allow up to four to six weeks for shipping of this product. Um, so either he's outsourcing it um, on, on his rings or he's, you know, making them from scratch. I don't know. Um, you know, most likely they're probably just, you know, outsourced. Um so, you know, give Brayden a little bit of time. I mean, he finds all the best plugs, all the best connections to get you guys, to get us the best product, uh, even if he does outsource it. I mean, his rings are super affordable, 875 bucks. I mean, it's a beautiful ring. You get the engraving, you got the diamonds. Um, you know, he's got some heat here, you know what I mean? Um, and and to be, to, be, to be honest, out of all the rings he has, that's the only one I want is right there, the diamond flat ring. 
I mean, the, the flooded one's nice, but it's 1500 bucks. They're small diamonds. Ain't nothing serious. I ain't spending 1500 bucks on that. I'll spend 875 with them, though, with the 10% discount. I will spend that. So that's my next purchase coming up. I don't know what we're going to get engraved. I'm probably going to be a cliche, just get 1993 or something. Um, and then, of course, my wife, she's absolutely ridiculous. She wants the 7 millimeter eternity ring. And I'm just like, Jesus Christ, man. I mean, come on, man. I told her about all the fucking rings you want. You want that bullshit. I love it. I just don't like the fucking price. Because, I mean, at the end of the day, <laughs> you know what I mean? Ten years from now, we we hit we hit Skid Row, lose our jobs and shit, broke as hell. I mean, that ring, I'm going to get smacked over the head on, bro. There ain't going to be really nothing there. I mean, you got the stones, but you, they ain't, you, know, you, you ain't getting paid on the stones, man. You're getting paid on the metal. So always remember that, you guys. I mean, don't think for a second you're going to purchase this $5,000 ring and you'll be like, oh, yeah, man, uh, they're VSG color diamonds. Yeah, it don't mean shit. I mean, you got four, four and a half carats, uh, 2.5 millimeter diamonds. Uh, so a little over dubs. I mean, they're nice diamonds. There's nice size diamonds and everything. But again, I mean... What you're going to get paid per carat is going to be a freaking joke. Um, and this ain't me bashing Brayden. That's a beautiful ring, man. I mean, you can't expect to get that ring for $1,000. There's no question about it. Brayden has amazing products. Uh, he's not overpriced. He's very fair with market prices. Um, you know, so that's not a bash whatsoever. I'm just, you know, this channel is for everybody that's you know, might be a little bit new to jewelry. We're going to, we're going to make it, you know, together. We're going to stick together and we're going to, you know, figure out, figure out the best investments. You know what I mean? Um, this ring right here is more so an investment for <clears throat> basically you got some money to throw up in the air. You know what I mean? I mean, you got all your chains, you got a bunch of gold and silver stashed away. Um, and when I mean silver, I mean like silver bars, you guys, just like stupid, stupid bars and stuff like that. And, uh, and yeah, man, so let's, uh, we gonna, we gonna keep repping, you know, Jacoji Jaco gang over here and, uh, shout out to Brayden. He's plugging. So go holler at your boy. He's got that 10% discount going on. And, uh, yeah, man. So. I can't be any more happy with his service. I, I, I'm sitting here making video after video, man. His service is absolutely phenomenal. And you guys have a wonderful night. Let me stop blabbing because I'm just in the mood to blab. Um, and yeah, man, uh, you guys take care. And we'll make another video. I'm going to do a couple. I got some new silver bars in, uh, that I got uh, from online. So from Monarch, I'm going to do a little unboxing video coming up. And then my next video is going to be talking about how, unless you're going not going to garage sales and estate sales, my next video is going to be about how you can, how you can get scrap sterling silver pieces. And when I say scrap, I mean, they're still beautiful jewelry pieces. Remember in my past video, if you've watched, I was kind of bashing silver, but I'm really not. Uh, I love silver just the same, especially as an investment. I mean, silver is being used in every solar panel. Tesla, the Tesla engines require, I think, in uh, 40 grams, which is over an ounce of silver per engine, per battery, whatever you want to call them. Um, there's so many uses for silver. Silver is still the best conductor. And um, like I said, right now, if if you if I had a hundred, if you gave me a hundred thousand dollars and you said. This $100,000 is going to be for you to invest in either gold or silver. You can invest in gold, you can invest in silver, or you can invest in both. I would invest 80%, all right? If you gave me $100,000, $80,000 would go to silver and $20,000 would go to gold right now. Um, you know, we're at like 23 an ounce on silver. It ain't going much lower. Let's just get up in there, you know, get your little 10, 15,000 ounces. And then once gold, once silver gets up to 45, 55 an ounce, you're going to be sitting real pretty. Um, I mean, that's my, that's my goal and I ain't got close to it, <laughs> but I'm doing all right. 
And uh, you guys have a good one. And uh, I'm going to get off this video because I'm just here blabbing. Make sure you fast forward through all the bullshit. And uh, have a good one, guys. Peace.